An investigation is underway right now after a case of active tuberculosis tied to Joppa Town High School. WMAR 2 News Jeff Hager has the efforts to detect any others who may have been infected. Due to medical privacy, we don't know if the person infected with tuberculosis here at Joppa Town High School is a student or not. We just know they're no longer present here. TB spreads through the air from one person to another and after prolonged exposure in an enclosed space and usually affects the lungs. County Deputy Health Officer Dr. Jamie Seibel says contact tracing is now the first order of business. An exposure time between four and eight hours in an enclosed space. So four hours typically for a very small space and eight hours typically for a larger space like a classroom. And we're able to identify people based on exposure time. The health department will be testing anyone who may have been in contact with the infected person now and also we'll be testing them again in eight to ten weeks. Already the health department has issued a letter and a fact sheet to parents, guardians, and staff members alike here at the school. In the meantime, they're being asked to report any possible symptoms. If somebody has active tuberculosis disease, the symptoms include night sweats, fevers, chills, a cough lasting more than three weeks, which could sometimes have blood in it, loss of weight, um, and loss of appetite. County health officials learned of the case from the Maryland Health Department after they were notified by a hospital facility. We're told the investigation has not caused any disruption in normal school activities. In Harford County, Jeff Hager, WMAR 2 News.